Wagwan people and welcome to the new Master League with Liverpool and John Barnes as manager and for me the greatest Jamaican slash English player of all time. There's a reason I love football, he's my idol John Barnes, he's the reason I support Liverpool, everything in there and now he's got the chance to take over Liverpool Football Club. And as you know with Pez you only get certain managers to pick from, certain different face identities this brother looks just like John Barnes, so you know what, we did Kevin Keegan last season, we made Kevin Keegan up. And Liverpool going back to the boot room days, back in the days where you were ex-player or ex-coach, that's who became the next manager. And John Barnes, probably what, John Toshak, Kevin Keegan, only a few that didn't ever do that. And John Barnes has now got the chance to become Liverpool manager. So here he is at the stadium, at the ground, having a look around. So I've got obviously the Become a Legend series, Reggie Boy Jr, as you know, check it out. We've also got the Reggae Boy Rovers Master League, which is going to be the default team as you start off with. So this is going to be the actual club side team. John Barnes is in charge. Realistic transfers if we can. All right, John Barnes, I'd like to discuss this season objectives. What are we saying, brother? As sports directs, I think our best uh, place to win for Champions League. What, to win Champions League? Dallas brother's pressure from early doors, man. <coughs> this brother does not mess it about. All right, man. All right, Stavros, what are you saying then? Okay. Um, to be honest, man, as a Liverpool fan, to win the Champions League is brilliant, but I think we should also take the league. We should focus on the league, you know. And I'm going to say, going to take both of them. That's a big ass. Let's say we should focus on the league. For me, league's bread and butter. Although I'm eager to bring home Champions League glory, you know what I mean? Uh, it should be a top priority. Instead, we should embark and we crown national champions by winning the league. That's what I'm saying. John Barnes is chilling. He's saying, look, brothers, look, don't make me fire on the first day. We're going for the league. No messing about. All right? What are you saying? So, alright, they're all nodding in agreement, okay. Actually, I happen to agree with you. Aim for the league title. Alright, okay, good. We're on the same wavelength, you know what I mean? The sporting director nearly got sacked on his first day, you know what I'm saying? And the brother agrees with me. What's his brother saying? We're the same mind. Okay, that's it. That's all you got for me. Okay, fair enough then. That's it. Alright, so we move on. Everyone's in agreement. John Barnes first day in. Club legend. What can he do? So, Going to hit up the main screen now. I'm probably going to keep this similar sort of formation. We're going to meet the press first though. Here he goes, John Barnes, first Liverpool press conference. Looking suave as hell. Brother's in there. That's my, that's my lawyer in case somebody tries to kick off anything. So what you got for me then, brother? First question. Congratulations appointment. You're quite the journeyman manager. What? This is my first, what? I've only been to Celtic and that's it in this. Having managed a number of clubs, you consider the current appointment. Um, to be honest, it's a fresh start. It's a great moment in my football career. It's a career highlight. He's playing for Liverpool. He's managing Liverpool. I'm so grateful for the favour the club's shown me. I hope to repay it. I don't know if it's my greatest achievement, but it's certainly a highlight. I'll tell you this, when I got the call, it only took me a second to say yes to the offer. Exactly, John Barnes knows what he's saying. Alright, next question, brothers. What you got for me? Come on. Alright, Barnes. You finish up your thing, Barnes. Come on, man. People are watching. Still talking. Come on, John Barnes. Damn. All right, okay. <laughs> what style of football do you want to play this season? So John Barnes, if you brothers are young viewers, check him out on YouTube back in the day. His brother was like the Jamaica Messi on the left wing back in the day. So he's a clean sportsman like, yeah, he was a clean footballer. Um, but for me, John Barnes was the flair, the wing play. So it's all about putting a show on for John Barnes. All right, you can't blame the people wanting to see results. But I'm opinion that putting on a good show is just as important as winning. If you're going to win, make sure you win in style, brothers. Uh, and the type of style of football we'll see. You know what I mean? The fans want to see it. That's what I aim to show. All right? That's all I'm done now. Two questions, that's it. That's all you got, brothers. I'm out. Peace and love. Let's go. Come on, man. Let's go. We've got stuff to do. So Johnny Barnes having none of it. Two questions. That's it. I'm out. Peace. So here we go. We're going to hit the main screen. We'll have a look at some players. Now, being a Liverpool fan, I have my own opinions on the players and what we can do. This is your main screen, brothers. You've probably seen it a couple of times now. Obviously, uh, Pez has been out for a few days. If you haven't got it, you've probably seen a couple of the videos on YouTube and this thing. So thank you for joining me on this bad boy. So let's have a quick look at the game plan. I think 4-3-3 is the best thing for these brothers. The only thing for me I'm thinking of doing is switching it up a little bit uh, and bringing an attacking midfielder into sort of play into here. Um, dropping that back a little bit down there. And let's just sit with two here in this brother. So again, I'm thinking more like this kind of thing. And for me, uh, Fabinho in there, make him a defensive bad boy. Maybe push Henderson a little bit. And then drop in Ox in that bad boy. I mean, Ox is supposed to be a centre midfielder. I mean, he's 82 as a centre. I mean, come on, he's better as an attacking midfielder. Uh, and then, yeah, keeping these brothers out wide a little bit. We've got 87% uh, team cohesion. 
I like the rest of it. For me, personally, I'd rather see Gomez get a bit better on this. I think Gomez is going to go in for Matty. But the starting 11 pretty much picks itself a Liverpool. I mean, it's a great 11. We've got some good little youngsters as well. Brewster in there. Uh, Curtis Jones. Harvey Elliott's in that piece. Van der Berg as well. Hoover in the house. But looking at the squad, uh, we need cover for one of the Mane and Salah, to be honest. We've got a Reed, We've got Brewster. We've got Shaq, man. But we need a cover for them when they're wings, brothers. So... We're going to press on with a little bit of that. John Barnes is going to get straight into the action. Uh, and what we're going to do, uh, we're going to look at the squad as a whole. What we've got, we've got 160 million. Now, I put transfer frequency on normal, budget on normal, everything else on normal, do you know what I'm saying? So, I didn't think we'd get this much money. I won't, I dread to think what you get on large. And we've still got a budget of £178,000 a week we can give somebody. So, I reckon we can get rid of a few players as well. And we've got, so we've got them three brothers up front. I'd rather play Brewster over Origi. Try and get him boosted up a little bit if we can. Finishing's nearly there, 71. Uh, like I say, Elliot again. We'll keep him around the club. Because again, if we can develop him. We've got our other winger. We've got Shakir in the meantime. But we do need another winger in there, I do believe. Uh, midfield is stacked with players. To be honest, personally, I like Lalana, but... I think we can get rid of Lallana. We've got Keir. I mean, we've got a lot of midfielders in there. Jones as well. I want to play him as well a bit more. So, yeah, you know what? I'm sorry, Lallana. I like he's a player, but I think Lallana's got to go, you know. Going down to the fullbacks and stuff. Again, Hoover's probably too young to be starting just yet. We'll keep him around the squad for the bench, maybe. I think we'll keep Klein for a season. Trent's obviously starting. Uh, we've got no spare left back in the building. So, a left back could be called upon. Goalkeeping wise, I mean,. Lana gonna know you there because people are injured, but let's be fair, this brother doesn't need to be here anymore. We've got Keller as well. I mean Keller can go out on loan. Adrian Allison's more than enough. And we've got Vandenberg in the house. 68 rated. To be honest, looks a good little player. We've got Lovren, Gomez, Matic, Van Dijk. So again, for me, Lovren wants to go. It looks pretty good on this. The, the speed is always a thing for me. 72 speed, 68 acceleration. Matip is 73, 68. Not much difference, to be honest. And personally, I think Lovren has to go. So maybe another centre-half. Definitely a left-back. Definitely a winger. So let's hit the market up. Let's see what's going on this thing. We'll send the scouts out as well. Um, but for me, looking at a lot of it, and you know what I'm like, man. Jamaican brother in the house. For me, I think Leon Bailey to cover them wings. I know you might be thinking, oh yeah, Bailey, but yeah, trust me. Bailey at Liverpool could be the new John Barnes. And you know what I mean? For John Barnes to sign the new John Barnes, basically, I think it would be a good thing. 22 years old. Look at all the gamesmanship as well. Oh my goodness. All these type of things. So you know what? We're going to start negotiations. Let's have a little look. Oh, damn. Okay. The club is resistant to part oh, in one of their key players. Uh, has he got a uh, got a release clause? Oh, okay, so he got a 70 million release clause. So we're going to spend a hell of a lot of money on this, brother. But I think it could be the way forward. Now, what we're saying, he's not convinced the role at the club might be the right one. So let's give him a three-year deal. I don't think, at the moment, Bailey looks like he's interested. We're going to stack everything up. He's still not convinced. He's still not happy. Hmm. Even if we drop his minimum fee release... We're doing the wrong way. We really need to, if you really need, you need to hand on negotiation with care. Okay. Well, there's not really much else I can give you, brother. I've given you everything there. You know what? We'll send it out. I think we're going to be, we're going to be struggling there with Bailey. And to be honest, brother, we do need to have a look at some other brothers, see what else is out there, to be fair. So let's have a little look. Let's have a little look while you're on here. So we're going to go position. We're going to go, uh, or right wing. We'll leave them bad boys out. Again, we want young players to build up. We don't want anything now, really. We could resell it later on as well. Let's have a quick look what's about. So, I think affection on this is who can come. I mean, my goodness, 180 million from Mbappe. So, again, Rashford. I mean, why would Rashford be interested in going to Liverpool? Let's be honest. Um, okay, we're going to go with one position there. So let's go with the, your overall rating. Dembele's in there. Again, not massive on there. Federico Chiesa would be a good one. Not bad at all. Um, Malcolm's in there. Neves, Neves from uh, Ajax. Very interesting. No look pass. Long range shooting. Let's bang him on there. 
Obviously Bailey, as you know. Um, Jaden Sancho. Now again, very interesting. Definitely a lot of skill moves. Everything's in there. A lot of pace as well. Vinicius Junior's in the house. Again, probably cost us a fortune. Sancho's 90 million market value. 80 million release flea. Vinicius Junior's a lot cheaper. This could be an option. Uh, who else we got in here? Paula Pulisic, obviously just gone. Jao Felix, again, just gone to Atletico Madrid. Wrong sort of position anyway that we need. I mean, why would Wan-Bissaka come and join us as well? There's a few brothers on here that you're thinking, no way. So you know what, we're going to let the Bailey bid ride. Rodrigo's in there, I like him as well. Just gone to Real Madrid though. Gerson's in the piece as well. Obviously Harry Wilson's at Bournemouth. We'll keep an eye on Harry Wilson. We might buy him back and bring him back at the end of the season. Uh, Phil Foden's in there. Phil Foden's interested quite a bit, but we are stacked in midfield. And again, we're trying to keep it realistic as we can. So Bailey at the moment for me looks the one. Harry Wilson will keep on the list, as you know. Um, Harvey Barnes as well. Quite interesting. Hasn't really got the pace that we want up front, really. Got some skill moves. Ryan Sessions just gone to Tottenham. So again, we want to keep it realistic as we can, brothers. So yeah, we'll let the Bailey one ride. Let's see what happens. Um, we're also going to be looking at a left back as well. Let's have a quick gander at this bad boy. And again, maybe fairly young resale value. Possibly Chilwell, maybe a few others. Obviously, Gomez can do a job there, as we can see. There's Angelino, that would be realistic though. Balotore from Monaco. Not too bad, great pace, good crossing. 182 centimeters, so some nice height as well in there. Pinpoint crossing. So not bad at all. It's a good option. Um, Tierney would have been my option if he hadn't gone to Arsenal in real life. I think him and Robertson would make great pairing on that side. But again, unrealistic about getting them. Uh, Renny Lodley, I think he's just gone there. So is Hernandez to Milan. So we're getting, we want to get realistic brothers in there. Cucarera. With the headband on. Chilling. Ayago. And again, it'd be nice to sort of maybe search the sort of English players as well. Try and keep an English vibe going on if we can. But to be honest, there isn't that much going about. So we're going to let the Bailey one ride for a little bit, to be honest. But otherwise, I'll spend days searching for that. I'll have a little search off camera. We're going to move on. We're going to get on with the get on. Uh, we've done everything else that we need to do. I'll set up the scouts and everything like that. We'll press on. See if anything comes up with any kind of bids. And I'll bring you back with anything going on. If not, we'll go straight up. We're in for the Super Cup as well. But someone's coming back already. See what Bailey's saying. My bid for one of our players. Oh no, there's no association with Bailey. Okay, the terms for, he's demanding a low contract release fee. So what's he demanding? 70 million release fee. So pretty much, he wants the same release fee as we're paying for him. Come on, Bailey. He may have an eye on his next club. But Bailey is there and Bailey is ready to sign. So I think we know what we're going to go with Bailey. It's a lot of money. Doesn't leave us that much with a left back. We can't play Milner there. We can't play Fabinho there and stuff like that. Klein, stuff, Gomez. We've got options. So you know what? Brother Bailey's going to join. Leon Bailey. We're going to accept the terms. 70 million. Gives us 46 left. Just less than 85 contracts on there. So yeah, we've got room. And again, we're going to sell a couple of players with a bit of luck. But Leon Bailey. John Barnes, his first signing. Left winger back in the day. Signs a left winger himself. The Jamaican brother as well. Who did have an option to play for England like John Barnes did. But here he is. Should get a little cutscene for this brother, hopefully. There he is, at the ground. Took four days to get there. Four days out of the negotiation period. What's going on there? All right, the sporting director showing him round. All right, brother, welcome. Press conference, Leon Bailey joins the club. More pace, more skill, more flair up front for that Liverpool squad. We do need a left back. Uh, I wouldn't mind Ben Chilwell from uh, Leicester, maybe. Something like that. We'll have to see. Uh, we're looking maybe at the Preston left back as well. There's a good lad down there, young English left back. And there's also Rico Henry running about. But Bailey, this is just amazing. It's a very special day for me. I'm looking forward to every moment to come at this club. So Leon Bailey joins Liverpool. To me, winning and it is as important as anything. I'm ready to play. I can't wait to see you on match day. All right, Bailey, big up yourself, brother. So Leon Bailey signs for Liverpool. Congratulations, signing a new player. All right. So he's up in the piece. The scouts come back with some things as well. 
So here he is, Leon Bailey, 82 rated in the house. We've still got 45 million to go. Uh, no other bids for any other players yet. It will come later on in the transfer window, no doubt. Let's see what the scouts come back with. Gundogan, again, not realistic. We ain't going to sign Gundogan. All right, brother. So we're going to press on. So I'm going to do some other transfer stuff like that. We have got Chelsea coming up in the Super Cup. If nothing comes up, I will see you at kickoff, brothers. Euro Super Cup, brothers. Liverpool versus Chelsea. Bailey's on the bench. Will he come and make his debut? Not much in the transfers. Nobody's been released. No one's gone. But we've had a bid accepted for Ben Chilwell. So 27 million. It looks like the left back could be coming in after this game. All right. Force up the squad a little bit. I think we'll be good after that. We may sneak in maybe a little youngster. Maybe might buy one in from there. But to be honest, I think Bailey and Chilwell on that left hand side. Just strengthens up the squad, no ends. But here we go. Europa Super League Cup. All right. The Champions League winners versus the Europa League winners. It's at Ibrox, brothers. Let's get it. Quick look at the lineup. John Barnes, his first game. We've also got the Charity Shield as well. That'll be in the next episode. And they'll be straight into the Premier League fixtures. Van Dyke in the building. And again, I get all my kits. Sorry, it's going to be my <laughs> We got all our kits from Pez Universe. Big up the Peg of Universe, man. Unbelievable, man. Easy to do, follow the instructions straight in, hooks you up. And here we go. Here's a Liverpool lineup. John Barnes, his first lineup. Allison in goal, Robertson, Van Dyke, Gomez, Trent, Henderson, Fabinho, Chamberlain, Salah, Mane, and Firmino in the building. Here's your Chelsea lineup. All right. Three brothers in there. Pulisic's got no picture. Pedro's looking happy as anything. Tomori plays a right back. So Mane could have him today. Let's have that. All right, let's get it, brothers. All right, a few last words from Dave. There's Momo. Pedro's ready. Henderson's in the building. All right, Super Cup on the line. Here we go. John Barnes, his first game in charge. So we're still rocking with a 4 3 3, but we're rocking a bit more of an attacking midfielder in that position instead of three holding ones in there. We're going to go right across again. A little pull of early doors are in. Not the greatest touch from Robertson. And it's been moved back though. Here's Henderson. Angle's nice for a shot though. He's not going to take it. Chamberlain will from distance though. Didn't always rise in though, but early doors. Liverpool putting that pressure on. Liverpool fans showing their appreciation. Four minutes in. Van Dyke's up with Giroud. Kind of 50 50. Comes out with Liverpool's way though, but man, he may take this. You know, Kante is just in there in the nick of time. Henderson going across for Alonso. Back in. Chelsea play the way out nicely. Played up top. Giroud nearly gets it, but Van Dijk intercepts. And Liverpool can play their way out of it. John Barnes is Liverpool. Jurgen Klopp's decided to take on the Germany job. John Barnes has stepped up to the mark. Ah, little flick on. Don't get it, though. Can he carry on the good form that Klopp showed with the team? Robertson sticks a foot in there. <laughs> Damn, brother. And he hits a yellow card. What the rat? Just a normal tackle. There is no combination. There's no up, right, left, right there. You know what I mean? There's nothing you can do. Oh, my goodness. I didn't deliberately follow, brother. Robertson booked early doors. The referee from Lithuania ain't playing no games, man. Right, lose it. Trent, nicely done. Unorthodox, but nicely done. And away you go, Liverpool. Nice ball inside. Mane's got the pace to burn. Can we send him again? We can. Get in the box, Momo. Where you at? Mane's in there. Ah, not cut back enough. Bobby can pick it up, though. Blocked away. Liverpool back in ascendancy. Cross ball in. Bobby's in again. Header down. Bobby Firmino nearly made it 1 0. Liverpool putting Chelsea under the cosh. Mourinho maybe should have done better here. Robertson ball in. 50 pence head. He's gone wide. All right, Chelsea goal kick. Liverpool with all the possession. The games like this are dangerous on Pez. You can dominate. And literally a set piece or something. And then before you know it, you're 1 0 down. It's Fabinho. Back to Van Dijk. Going out wide to Mane. Can get one on one with Tamore. Gonna do the brother for pace. Tamore just gets something on it. Man, trying to whip it back into the middle though. Comes to nothing and Chelsea can break. Nicely won again. Fabinho. Here's Mane. He's in. 
Side foot round, 1 0 Liverpool. And the opening goal of the Super Cup goes to Mane and Liverpool. 1 0 up. John Barnes is happy. Got his first goal as manager. Won by Fabinho beautifully. Into Fabinho, into Mane. Keeper's already committed. Slotted in the corner. And Liverpool take the lead. Won the loop in the way for Super Cup. Just what we needed. Haven't seen much of Mohamed Salah so far though. Trying to get him into the game. Van Dijk needs to come across. Mane's come back though, which is good. Lovely defending and away he goes. Mane is unreal on this game. Inside. Chamberlain. Out wide to Momo. Chamberlain's back in again. His brother's in this time. Oh, poor touch Ox. What was that, brother? Thinking about Little Mix too much. I can't blame the brother, but damn. Ox should have buried that. Just overran it a little bit. He's back in though, trying to get a redeemer in. Giroud can turn. Nice ball inside. Liverpool opened up. And Chelsea back in it. Just like that. Who's that brother than Pulisic? Klopp's former man. Just like that. First chance for Chelsea. First thing they've done in that half. Torn apart. The American dream. To be honest, the defending was shocking. Ball in here. He backed off a little bit. Henderson tried the wrong side of him. Inside, Pulisic has got time. And to be honest, beats Allison convincingly. So the lead didn't last long for Liverpool. Oh my lord. <laughs> Thought was a brother there. Thought was a brother injured. Oh my lord, what the wrath. Oh, a little bit of schoolboy error there. You get the full game, so you're not getting none of this. None of this edited out. You're going to get the errors now and again that you'll miss on other YouTubers. We happen sometimes, brothers. Win it, win it, Bobby. Damn. Oh, Chelsea playing a dangerous game back there. Oh, referee again. He's Lithuanian. He's light to these challenges. Here's Giroud. Chelsea trying to play Liverpool's out of position. They're doing well there, though. And Mane is free. Ah, one ball for Bobby though. He's going to put the pressure on Zuma. Back to Kepa. And Chelsea's survived quite comfortably. Robertson wins it. Mane can turn. Inside Bobby. Little flick on. Here's Momo. Can't get rally defender. Zuma's done well. Momo's won it back though. Referee says play on. Waiting for Trent. There's no one there. Back to Henderson. Inside to the Ox. Switched again to Robertson. On a yellow card though. Inside Mane, Robertson, back in again, he's got time to look up, Bobby's on his own, it's gone over Bobby, ah, it's gone past Mane too, Chelsea survive again, nice little turn, Ox is back in, breaks it up, Mane can win this as well, he can, Liverpool can break one more time, Ox is in behind, into Bobby, Bobby's poor touch though, and what is going on with this Liverpool team? Getting into positions, but the touch has been terrible. Half time, it's 1 1. John Barnes' team need to get a grip of this. And a half time tour. Barnes wants to start off his career with a win and with a trophy. And to be honest, with the possession and chances we had, we should have been at least 2 1 up. It's a nice switch, though. Chelsea's right back tomorrow, he's gone forward. And the referee again from Lithuania. Literally, it's a non-contact sport for him. Do not send this brother off. Oh my goodness, we're going to have to sub Robertson off at this rate. Um, no, no, we'll leave him for another five minutes, but if Robertson gets sent off, this referee, I swear down. Win your header, brother. Nicely done. Bobby can win it again. Ox can't get the second ball. He can, he beats Kante to it, and away they go. He's going to send Momo through. Mohamed Salah's in. Keepers off his line. Oh, it's gone wide. You need to put your money on Momo scoring that. John Barnes can't believe it, but he appreciates the run. But Mohamed Salah should have buried that bad boy. Touch inside. The angle's there. Trying to whip it round him. Too much curl on the bad boy. Oh, nah. Ratted. Oh, we've still got a long way to go in this half, though. Chelsea are making moves though. Kovacevic is on. What can Liverpool do? Switched out to Henderson. Trent's making that run. Momo wants it. He gets it. Momo's got time to turn. 
Trent's on the overlap. Cross ball in, Firmino's there. And in the end, the Chelsea defender, I think it's Astro Pelt, has to give it out for a corner. Trent's going to take this 85 rated. I'll take that, brother. I'm going to go for the train set piece. Trent whips it in. Fabinho's underneath it. Again over the bar. Liverpool creating chances. Seems to kind of break that defence though. 35 left to play. And Dyke's up for it. Wins it. Power header. Fabinho's back in there. Momo's made the run. Into Bobby. Bobby's in as well. There we have it. Liverpool back in the lead. And what a great move from the front three. And Bobby Firmino, celebration and all. Liverpool 2, Chelsea 1. John Barnes' team back in full effect. Fast flowing move, beautiful football. Broken down in midfield. Mane into Momo, back into Bobby. Gets past his man. And again, the side foot finish, simple as you like. It's here on restyle. Liverpool 2 1 up, 58 minutes played. John Barnes will be looking at some substitutions now. Van Dijk knocks it down. Liverpool can go again. They've got three against three. They're backing off from Bobby. They're backing off from Bobby. Oh, he's put it wide. Trying to curl it round his man. Fair play for Bobby. We can be greedy now and again. Let's have a quick look at the bench, brothers. Let's see what we can do. Everyone seems to be pretty okay. Maybe Henderson a little bit. Let's get um, Robertson off, to be fair. <laughs> We haven't really got anyone kind of dropping at left back, unfortunately. We'll give Bailey a little bit of a run out as well soon enough. So we know what we're going to go Jimmy Milner back in the day. He did a job at left back a couple of seasons ago until Chilwell comes in. But well done, Robertson. Let's not get sent off though, brother. Milner's on. Desperate Dan Chin. And we'll just slot straight back in at left back. And we'll look to take Henderson off because we wanted to see him lift the trophy, obviously. That's if we do come out of the win. We better not count our chickens just yet. We may take uh, Bobby off if he's getting a bit tired. Bring Bailey on. No free kick in there. Liverpool no players asking for it. And the defender. Block through. Allison makes a wonderful save. And Trent stops him from going from a corner. Can we keep it in? Momo can't. We're probably going to wait till the ball gets into their half at least before we uh, make a change. But James is coming on for tomorrow. Another youngster. I don't believe uh, Chelsea got a transfer ban on this game. It'd be funny if they did. Uh, inside again now here's Kante back to Jorginho blocked out by the ch Chamberlain Momo with a beautiful touch and away they go and Chelsea have committed players forward and here's Momo on the run no one's with him what are you doing keep he's off his line Bobby can get the rebound another save and he's offside trying to chip him from that distance should have gone for the over chip so you know what Barnes has knocked him up he said you know what brother get in there Brother Bailey's on his way. Firmino's coming off. Mane's going to go up top. And a home debut. So well done, Bobby. Take the applause, brother. Played his heart out today. Liverpool fans show their appreciation. 2-1 up at the moment. Bailey's coming on. Taking the number 18 shirt. Brother Bailey making his debut for Liverpool. Let's get it. So a fresh pair of legs for Liverpool. We've still got one more sub in the bag. Up you get, Gomez nearly wins it, Fabinho gets a second ball though. Robertson can't find his man, it's not Robertson, it's Milner isn't it on the wing, he's lost out already. Only leading by a single goal remember, ball's coming in. Woo! And to be fair, Zuma should have, why is Zuma up there, what the rats is Zuma doing up front? But either way the brother should have finished that. And Liverpool nearly caught him, done. Milner needs to switch on, it's been a while since he's played left back. Oh, we're going to have to go along, Chelsea putting the press on. Mane's underneath it, he's strong enough to win it, nearly falls to Momo, doesn't know, they go along, Milner this time's in position, but he's headed it again across the way, Jimmy Milner, what are you doing brother? Gomez is coming across, Pulisic is in there, and Chelsea's goal scorer nearly comes up trumps, here's Joe Gomez, he step out a bit more, into Henderson, waiting for Trent to make that run, he does, Trent's just as tired though, gets the touch past, Inside, Henderson, back to Trent, it's going to get through though, Chelsea can't keep it out, ball across, Bailey's up then, Milner's in there, don't get a second ball, and away go Chelsea, 
Danger time now, Van Dijk. Whew. Not Van Dijk, Gomez is in there and Gomez is switched on to it. And Liverpool avoid the danger. Here's Milner inside Chamberlain. Across to Henderson. Brothers shattered. Trent's made the run though. A few minutes left to play. Salah into Mane. Ends it. He does. It's Liverpool's trophy. It's Liverpool's night. Sadio Mane with the goal. Liverpool 3, Chelsea 1. John Barnes is happy. The first trophy in the bag for the brother. Nice little interplay. Chelsea pulled apart. Trent cuts in. Momo with a little spin move. And Mane's got all the time in the world to pick his spot. Uh, Emerson, last change for Lampard. We'll make one more as well. We've got a bit of room to manoeuvre now. What hand does he stay on? Want to lift the trophy. So you know what? Let's give uh, Curtis Jones a little run out. We'll try and get these youngsters built up a little bit as well in this game. It's a well played Chamberlain. Curtis Jones comes on. Try and promote some of these younger players to Liverpool. Especially like Brewster, him, Hoover. Try and get as many games as we can. Chip ball forward. Gomez underneath. Deals with it well. And Chelsea are leaving space everywhere now. Momo can go past him, he can. Oh, a little touch. Falls for Henderson. Plays it inside. Bailey's there. Should have maybe gone to the nearer man. Trying to get Bailey involved on his debut. Luke will have the throw though. Momo whips it in. Man is on his own again. Where is the marking from Chelsea? And that's it. Sadio Mane has his hat trick. Liverpool 4, Chelsea 1, John Barnes, what a debut brother, what a move, Momo picks his spot and the Chelsea defender just washed it over his head, what is that brother doing, Pepper had no chance and Liverpool have torn Chelsea apart, look close at half time, for the second half these brothers have just stepped it up a gear, nice ball inside, knocked through, Play through Chelsea in no. One last chance, Van Dijk. Allison with the save. Allison did not want to concede another one. What a save, brother. Six minutes of injury time. Kepa's up as well. <laughs> Let's get this clear. Chelsea have got the keeper up and they are 4-1 down. Clear it, clear it. All right, let's go. Run after it, man. I know you're shattered, brother, but they've got no keeper in. Win that ball. Ah, there goes Kepa now. Can we win it? Can we intercept it? It's gone long again. Send the brother. That's it, we're in. The Kepa's off his line. Oh, we can't go for the chip. Oh, the chip was weak from Bailey. Come on, brother. That would have been a beautiful debut. We tried to chip him from far, but it doesn't matter. We've won it. John Barnes gets his first trophy. He runs on the pitch. He doesn't care. Got his chinos from next. He got his shirt from George and Asda. He don't care. This brother's winning on the pitch. He's got his first trophy. Canty can't believe it. Another trophyless game for Chelsea. But John Barnes is his first trophy as manager. All be in the Super Cup, but it's still a trophy for the brother. Happy as Larry John Barnes. Well done, son. Liverpool fans take their applause. They were unbelievable in the second half. Feasted and feasted. John Barnes is happy. Puppy steps. Way for Super Cup winners, Liverpool. And again, the players greet John Barnes. Club legend, as you know. And we're going to see a trophy lift. I'm just going to build a celebration. Celebration on change since PES 2019. Come on, brothers. Hook some of them for this. Change so much more massively. Hook up a little bit of celebration. A bit of a walk up or something. But there we go. What a win for Liverpool. Like I say, half time, it was close. And then we just beasted and feasted in the second half. No complaints. Mane, man of the match. Rightfully so. So 4 1 Liverpool. Uh, like I said, we've got Chilwell deal pretty much in the bag. We're going on to the next day. We'll announce that and then we'll have the Charity Shield and the first game of the Premier League season in the next episode. So, like I said, we'll go down. Negotiation. Chilwell was in the bag already. 27 million. Uh, release fee is the same, though. The release fee thing on Pez is doing it. And unfortunately, you can't get it higher, stuff like that. So, we could lose him for the same amount of money we bloody bought him for. But it is what it is. Uh, we're going to get Chilwell in. Hopefully they'll sort it out in patches and all sorts of things. But half the time, I, mean, I get it if a player doesn't want to join you, but I mean the release fee the same as the transfer fee. I mean really, come on. But we're gonna release, we're gonna bring in Ben Chilwell. That'll give us cover at left back for Robertson. 
especially the Bulls are going to get booked all the time. And then we'll have the charity shield against Man City. And I haven't seen the fixture for the well, the opening game yet, but uh, we'll find out. Um, Chilwell signed, but there was no press conference. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, Chilwell, fair enough. Welcome. The brother didn't want to do a press conference, but there we go. So anyway, brothers, the next episode will include Manchester City in the charity shield and Sheffield United on the opening game of the season at Anfield, brothers. So in the meantime, smash the rass out that like button, hit the subscribe button if you're new, Wagwan, welcome to my channel. Check out the other Master League, check out Become a Legend as well, brothers, and other episodes on my channel. Hit the notification bell, you never miss a video that way. Peace and love, and I'll see you on the flip side. Peace! Say we know.